Please be seated. Diane. I sat down last night and tried to work out what I was going to say. But it was hopeless. You all knew Jack. You know what he was like? Decent. Kind. Strong. He could be awkward and stubborn and a right pain in the neck. And he was the best man I ever knew. I loved him and I was lucky enough to be his wife. The happiest day of my life was when I stood here and married him. I never imagined then that I'd be doing this. I'm okay. Annie gave me a letter that Jack wrote just before he died. To Victoria, Andy, Darren, and I hope one day, Robert. By the time you read this, I'll have gone. I'm sorry I didn't get the chance to say goodbye, but I want you to know that I'm proud of you all and I love you very much. I wish I could have come back and spent my last days on the farm with you because that's been my life. I've been thinking a lot about home lately and I feel blessed to have spent my life working on the land like my dad and his dad before him. When I was out in the fields, I used to feel them there with me. And I'll be there with all of you, in the rain and the snow, when the lambs arrive and when the leaves fall from the trees. That's a comfort to me. And I know I'm leaving the farm in capable hands. No, I can't. It's all right, Andy. Andy, don't go, please. Leave him be. It's all right, I've finished. But it's not good for you to sit about brooding. So why don't you go to school tomorrow? You need to get back into your normal routine. I'm not going back to school. Not here, anyway. I've got schools in Spain. It's such a sudden decision. You haven't had time to think it through. I have thought it through. I want to be in Spain with you, where my dad was. What about your family here? You're the only proper family I've got left. You and Robert, and he hasn't even turned up. You can go and see your gran any time during the holidays. You don't have to move there. But nothing's keeping me here. And he's giving up the farm. Does he's got his job at the garage. And Scarlet. I'm not going anywhere. I'll take care of you like you were my own daughter. You know that. I don't want to be here. I'm going to Spain whether you like it or not. I've always done what's best for this family. I don't like to see it falling apart, and that's what seems to be happening. So for fish in that. You changed your mind about leaving? No. How many times? As Ali said you could live with her. She will. But you can't go. Why not? Because a family needs to stick together. Now more than ever. I've said that to Andy. No, you haven't. And you won't, because you know you can't change his mind. And you won't change mine. I've heard it all before, and no one's given me a good enough reason to stay. Oh, this is home. This is where your life is. I can have a better life in Spain. You don't know that. That you're grieving because of Jack, we all are. But why don't you just wait a bit? Think about it. You're still not giving me a reason. I can't imagine living here without you being around. Like, I'd miss you. You've got Scarlet. What's the big deal if I'm not here? Like, I don't want to be a thousand miles away from you. I like you being around. I like seeing you. But I thought it was... That or what? 
I don't know. Mates? Brother? Sister? You know? No! I don't know. I guess what I'm trying to say... Look, the reason I want you to stay... I want you to stay for me. I was going to come and find you two. I'm going to Jack's grave to say goodbye. I thought we could all go together as a family. Yeah, I'll come. What about you? You might never get the chance again. I can't stop you leaving. I know it's what you want and I'll respect your wishes. But I don't want to lose you. You'll always be a part of this family, wherever you are. So come with us. Please. What are you doing here? Let's not fall out. Not here, not now. I wanted to say goodbye. That's why we're here. I don't blame you for being mad at me. I shouldn't have run out of church like that. There's no excuse for it. I'm not going to run away again. What do you mean by that? Leaving the farm won't solve anything. So you're going to stay? That's what my dad wanted. If I walk away then, I'll let him down and I can't do that. So I'm going to try and give it a go. I don't believe you. You're only saying it because you feel guilty. Eh? I mean every word does. I can't do it on my own. I need you to help me. Get lost. I don't trust you. I know. But I'll have to win your trust. I'm asking for a chance, that's all. But if you let me down, I'll do my best. That's all I can say. I miss you. I love you. I'm not going to try and take Dad's place. But you want me to help look after you. I can't do that if you're in Spain, can I? What about Gran? She'll understand. All right. I'll stay. Thanks. He'd be so proud of you. I wish Robert was here. He'll have me thinking about you. About all of us. How can you say that? Because I know Rob. He'd have been here if he could. Bye, Dad. You can rest in peace. We'll never leave you. <laughs>